seems like about maybe once a year or so I fight the war in my dreams. I finished my senior year in high school and didn't think too much about it for some dumb reason. I guess I was too stupid to realize what I was getting involved in or would be. 43 finally went over. When we got shipped over from Southampton to La Havre in France, and they put us on trucks. This, this is now in the wintertime, open trucks. They run us up into Belgium, and the Battle of the Bulge was, the Germans were starting their movement back, push, pushing them out of Belgium, trying to push the Americans out of Belgium. Literally dumped us off in the middle of a field. And uh, from that point on, we were in combat for 128 days it took to get from Belgium to Czechoslovakia, which was just south of Berlin at that time. And that's where we met the Russians and stopped. I don't know how many days I went without a shower. We were very poorly equipped for winter weather because we didn't have, we just had ordinary dress boots, dress leather face gloves, and a dress overcoat. We'd lost a lot of our guys from frostbite and from um, shells. And so we'd, we'd get replacements, new guys would be brought up to fill in. And we were, we started getting older men, older meaning 26, 27. Even two of them were married and had a child, you know. They were getting desperate here to, to get troops. But those, those older men were, were useless. I mean, they, they, they would stop and think of what's happening, where the young guys just did what you tell them and they, they did it, you know. I feel I was very fortunate. I was involved and I got in and got out in one piece. I was anxious to get back and get into a normal life. I eventually did get a, a BA and then I went on and got an MBA later on after that. I was an engineer. I had a very serious girlfriend before I left, and so I was very anxious to see her. But she'd gone to school out in New York City. <laughs> she went to school out there for interior design. And so when she came here, she got a job at Dayton's right away. We were married 67 years. We soon found out that we both liked to travel. And so as soon as the boys were, I had two sons, as soon as they were out of the house, we started traveling. 107 countries we traveled to. We've got to make a bigger effort to stay out of wars. I don't know how you're going to do it, because I've been doing it since day one. But uh, just got to do something to stay out of it. Doesn't do any good.